good job, Mama. Oh my gosh, he's huge. Oh, we're alive. Oh, thank God. Oh, here we go, Mama. Here we go, here we go. Here we go, Mommy. Mommy, here. Oh, good, good. Oh, good job, Mama. Oh, good job. the mama and you and two babies um, her first one was breech and I had to pull it I had no idea how hard I would have to pull to be able to get the baby out unfortunately he was stillborn um, but with some guidance from some good friends I was able to um, successfully pull out a second little uh, boy ram who she's currently taking care of. I'll show you a little picture. Talk about a learning curve. Um, I really had to pull very hard uh, to get him out. It was traumatizing for both of us, needless to say. <laughs> but next time I'll know how hard I need to pull to get the baby out and not to wait. I didn't realize <laughs> that... I just didn't realize. So I feel terrible that she lost one of her babies. Um, but at least she's got one good healthy one here that's already trying to get up and walk around. Um, anyways, so it was a bit of a rough afternoon. So another thing I've learned is that you have to check to make sure that mama has milk. And she does. So it looks like she also has a little extra nipple there, but hopefully it's not big enough to cause any problems. But you can see there's milk coming out. I can't get to the other side yet, so I can't check that. So, Mama's labor was a little bit um, intense. I ended up having to pull both the lambs. One was stillborn, as you know. And so, I'm going to give her some pain meds orally. It's called Banamine because, well, I just feel really bad. She's very traumatized by me having to pull her babies um, but at least she has one healthy one he's doing really well um, so I'm gonna try to get her up she hasn't been up I had to give him some of this um, colostrum until um, I can get her up so anyhow um, I'll let y'all know how it goes it's been about 30 minutes since I gave her the banamine, so she's definitely up and uh, letting the baby nurse. Um, she uh, is eating. Haven't seen her drink anything, but it's a good sign that she's eating. So I think we're all good. We did not have a third, so I think we're just waiting for the placenta to, to come out, and then we'll be all good. I just need to make sure that baby's eating. I did give him a little bit of colostrum, so 